Hello, and welcome back to Ponery's Penny Arcade, and this is the next 30, episode 2 of Spiritfarer, a gorgeously drawn and animated game which appears to be themed around, well, death and the afterlife. And so far in our travels, we have bid Sharon, the, the god of death, farewell, and we have met Albert, the shipwright, who helped us get our boat in order. We picked up our friend Gwen, who I haven't decided is a relative or a friend or family member or what yet, but we're working on that. We went to this location here, which allowed me to mine gloomy jellyfish that let us build a kitchen so we can fe uh, feed our uh, spirit friends that we have to pick up along the way. So as far as I can tell, uh, our job is to find spirits that are lost in the in the seas out here, board them on our ship, take care of their needs, and take them to the Evergate, right? Everdor, which is their ticket to the afterlife. Because when you die, apparently you can't go alone. Somebody has to guide you, much like most mythology. So anyway, where I left you last, Gwen told us we needed to go to Mostine Cove, so let's go ahead and do that and get underway. And while we're underway, I'm going to make the best use of my time by cooking, because we already got a lot of fish. So, let's cook some... mussels. Yeah, let's do that this time. <clears throat> and actually, that cooking time is kind of long, so we'll go ahead and do a little bit of fishing while we're waiting. Because I don't know if herring is the only fish. Like, I'm thinking that there's going to be, like, some rare or something that pops up eventually. I sure do get a lot of old shoes, don't I? I probably could have did it one more time. I know I said that last episode, but, you know. Can I touch Daffodil? No, not yet. That's my inventory. Okay. That's just so cool how it just keeps turning into things. Steamed shellfish. I hope the food doesn't go bad. Ah, we're almost there. You have arrived at your destination. Looks like Gwen's gonna come out and say something. Mostine Cove discovered. Got it. Look at that. Hmm. We should hop on that island over there. Sure, let's do that. You know what I forgot to check? If I could build that... Um, can't build the field or the garden yet. Okay, so we're going to have to find that in our travels. And that's fine. Looks like I have to wait for Gwen. I'm good to go. Alright, here we go. Empty bottle and a medium glim bottle. Okay. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Jesus. Yes, it's fine, I promise. It's the best way to get the wood I need. They regrow over time. Oh, I get to work with the cat. Oh, really? I get... Oh, okay. I'm using my analog stick right now. Well done. Got some logs. Okay. For you have become death, the destroyer of wor worlds. Yeah. Oppenheimer quotes in my game. Never thought I'd see that coming. That's how you do it. Go on. 
ahead, cutting down more trees. We can go back to the boat and build the field with all these maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Okay, so she's going to wait me out while I get to loot things on the island. That's fine. Can I take this tree? <coughs> I cannot. Ooh, what's this? Can't jump down to... Oh, yeah, I can. All right. Okay, I can't have that log. How about this? Okay. <clears throat> I love that teamwork type thing. It's like Wonder Twins Unite because I get to use my Everlight and then the cat uses its Everlight and then we get to do this. This is cool. There's another tree, some more logs. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Oh, okay. What? Oh, okay, I have to let go of the button. Oh, that took too long. <laughs> Every time I do that, she's like, is it gonna explode? Have to come at that harder. Nope. Do I gotta time that? There we go. Limestone. And I can't do anything more with that. Is this the end of the island? Yep. There's nothing glittering in the water, so I don't have any reason to. Um, to dive underwater. Sorry. Oops. There we go. So two logs and some limestone is our bounty. Oh, and some berries. That's right. And apparently there's nothing else I can grab from this. So I think we're done here. Let's talk. Oh, she doesn't want to talk. Okay, well let's get on the boat then. Wait, did I just leave her behind? Oh no, she's in there. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we want to build the field, right? Yeah, we want to build the field. So select and hmm. The field with a little bit of water and care, your cereal seeds will grow up into plants in no time. Right, okay. Can't do this. Uh, oh, okay, so it's changing the way that the ladders are. Like, I can do that and just have one ladder. Or this. Or this. I think I'll do it like... Do I want to do it like that? Yes. There we go. She's going to come check out my handiwork. A field. It's better looking than I thought. There's a little je ne sais quoi to it. If you don't know what that means, I don't know what. <laughs> Basically. Plus Yorkies. <clears throat> Simple but elegant. Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. Okay. We have to go find a man named Theodore. We're going to a place called Hummingburg. Raccoon Inc. Okay. Shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. This world has a serious problem of dubious business practices. But I don't want to get you swindled. Alright. <clears throat> Hummingbird. Alright. Yes. 
he is. <clears throat> it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. Okay. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill in the deck under the stars. Aha! Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. didn't ask for food. Oh wait, it's pretty much late night. Let's go ahead and sleep off tonight, since there's really not a lot I can do otherwise, right? Let's take a nap. Yes. That make this game makes it kind of easy. Like the bell is right there to let me know that it's time to wake folk up. She's out. I heard the door open. Oh, oh, she didn't like that. She didn't like that. Go mm -hmm. talk. Don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He's definitely a shark. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Should I give her food? I won't give her veggies. Ooh, can I make coffee? Steamed shellfish. Uh, dish type acquired taste. Yeah. Is that shellfish? Oh, no. No, no, no. Not for me. Sorry. Okay. Hmm. Well, what can I make her? Corn, fish, veggies. Yeah, let's make her a snack with berries. Oh, I have to have five of them. That's not going to work. Same with that. Okay. Corn. I have to have five of those. Okay. Well, I can't cook her anything now because she said she wants things that are different every day, right? So, well, I'll give her a fish. Let's try that. I'll give her a fish while we're underway. Even though it won't make her happy, at least it'll get her fed, right? Let's do that. Cook a fish. One. Oh, wait, I wonder if it's just, I could do as maximum of five. Let's try this. Yeah, that's what it is. I can do a max of five at a time. All right, let's go. Looks like we're headed to... Ooh, are these crates? Yep. All right, so I'm going to go here first since it's on the way, right? Seems prudent. Um, I might even have enough time to get in one thing of fishing. For the cooking part. The travel part, I could probably do two. Caring. Alright, let's go check on the food. Hang on, let me get your fish. Poached fruit. Yeah, that should be good. Let's give you food. Poached fruit. Dessert. Give. Mmm. Nope, she didn't want that either. Okay. Fair enough. So she is dead. Mm. Pedantic snobs. Mm. 
Yeah, this is your friend. Okay. It was rad. <laughs> okay, looks like we're at our destination, so she wants to come out. Ooh, there's a crate down there. Let's go check it out. Look at that. We got some seeds already. Nice. I tried to give you a snack. You didn't take it. Let's see. Can I make them? Can I make her anything else? Corn? Turnip? Uh, let's try the turnip, I guess. See what we get out of that. <clears throat> Need to go explore out here real right quick. Make sure all of this is, you know, discovered. What is that cat doing? Oh, he's riding the ball. That's kind of neat. <clears throat> Common muscle. Empty shell. Is there anything out here? Negative. See, there's still stuff. There is still stuff stuck on the boat, so I can get this empty. Come on, empty. Oh, I heard the bell. Grilled veggie. Okay, let's see if she goes for that. Oh, there we go. That worked out great. And she's happy. Sweet. All right, let's hop on the boat. Oh, we can't hop on the boat. Let's go. Hummingbird awaits. I thought I was here. Oh, wait, no, I stopped at the thing. Okay, my bad. We need to go here. <laughs> I also need to check my inventory. Oh, uh... Grains, seeds, planted in the field. Okay. Uh, hmm. Sweet, I get to choose, um, plant that, and then we'll plant, oh yeah, okay, so she said we needed to get linen, so boom, linen, done. Okay, now what do I do for water? Ah, nice. And we're in Hummingburg. So I don't even have to buy the stuff that I came here for because I found it on the way. Fantastic. Everything is underway. Just the way we need it. Alright. I think we're done. How do I hop out? Oh. Like this. It treats it like a building. Alright. We're here. Let's buy some seeds. Sure. Even though I already did it. But whatever. I have a bad habit of getting ahead of myself. Watch it take away everything we just planted as like a hard reset, like you weren't supposed to do that. Can't have the bushes. Ooh, who's this? Hello. Oh. I'm out here looking for the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden, maybe a pool. I'm not asking for much. Just can't decide. It helps to say it out loud. Well, good luck, bro. Hmm. Take a good look at this shrine. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this word or world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair and the Everlight. 
All right. The two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you can use ovals to activate it. But to get ovals, you need to welcome more spirits onto your ship. I'm sure you'll find more lost souls like me. You're a lost soul? Oh. Let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know. Your name is Mary? No. Marguerite? No. It's Missy. No. Wait, no. Eshi. Don't tell me it's... Oh, shoot. I'll get it someday. <laughs> My favorite spot is this bench at the end of the pier. It's beautiful and quite peaceful after a long day's work. Oh, my. I shouldn't have told you if I wanted to keep it that way. <laughs> what happened to that one dude that was running? Come back here. Is it you? <laughs> Stroll a day keeps the doctor away, which reminds me. I haven't been to the doctor in forever. Oh, no. Why did I think about health all of a sudden? Am I starting to feel unwell? I'm not sick. I'm okay. <laughs> right. Oh. Yes? Oh, I thought you had something to say. Mm. You love my hat. Our local shop, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage wares. <laughs> All useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Ooh, who's this big one? Oh. I'm going home. Don't follow me. Please. I hate when people know where I live. If you know my address, you'll tell people. Then they'll oh. tell people. Listen. I just don't want junk mail. <laughs> I should follow him. Wow, that raccoon did not look like I thought he would. There's Theodore. Alright. Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. Been servicing Hummingbird since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard-earned glims. Step right up. Alright, let's take a look. Key for Hummingbird. This key opens the door next to the broken ladder. Wow, you need a lot of money for that. When planted in the field... Okay, so this is the seeds. Linen seed. Wow. This stuff's expensive. So yeah, it's probably good that I found that stuff. Limestone. Man, everything's expensive here. Are you crazy? Especially if they have shiny glimpses. Don't be shy, have a look. Oh wait, I was supposed to talk to her about getting ripped off. These prices are out of control. I won't let them get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Good, let's do this. You should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. <laughs> people are you like people like you are the reason we have middle finger well you don't, you have cloven hooves. What? What is the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fair, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us, but I I can assure you my business practices are quite above board. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't allow this behavior one more second. <laughs> no more shenanigans, no more double crosses, just fair prices. I Stop being dishonest at once. Next time I see you, I'll try being nicer if you start being smarter. Got it. But, yes, yes, of course. <laughs> Please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. All right. Hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant some hell. You both look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. Really? I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You have to be able to jump in humanly high to make it. I guess you could use the stairs in that house. But some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever! Woo! Right. What the hell is that about? Can't do the jump. Good day to you. Good day indeed. 
excellent salesperson always carries what the customer needs. So, my well-off patron, what can I do you for? That key's still pricey. But at least everything else is back down to normal. Alright, so what I need is... Buy a linen seed. I already have this stuff. I want a carrot seed. I'll just take one of each. Even though I already have this stuff. That's good enough. Fantastic. Okay. If you've got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. Sure. Now, if I had hacks... I could somehow find a way to buy the key to go in there. Mm. Yes. Oh, okay, it's the same people. So, so far, I don't see any other lootables. Can I go into the house? Oh, sorry. Be gone, stranger. Okay. Can't use that. Oh, I can go in here. See, I didn't even have to buy these seeds. Damn it. Why did you make me buy the seeds? Okay, so all I can do is sit. Alright. Lovely. What about this place? Okay. There's really nothing here, is there? Wait, there's something here. More seeds. Great. Ah, what's this? I'm busy, miss. Sure. Okay. Well, we're getting on the boat then. It's too dark to navigate. Of course it is. Thankfully, I've already got all this stuff underway. Anything new I can make? No, we've already done every. We've already made one of everything, I think. All right. Well, in that case, let's go ahead and crash for the night. Very good. So, technically, it's the next morning, uh, but I don't want to ring the bell, because apparently Gwen doesn't like that. She's not a morning person. So I think what we'll do... What's this? There's a storm here. Alright, so we're not told to go there yet. I can go here and make some more money. I can go here and get crates. So we're going to do both of those things. We're going to start with this, since it's on the way. And... Let's see, is she asleep? Like, I'll let her sleep in. I don't care. Oh, she looks hungry. I'm gonna go talk to her real quick. Oh, maybe that's her sleeping animation. Let's ring the bell. It's morning enough now. Okay, did she like that? She didn't hate it. Okay, that's a good start. Oh, she wants to talk. Looks great. Way ahead of me. Your thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy, cozy little farm. Don't forget that you'll probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask. Just take my word for it. My gardening knowledge is as limited, limited as my father's empathy. Which reminds me. I believe it's time for you to find new people. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the oceans. But you are the spirit fair, and spirit fairs need spirits. Right. Okay, I gotta go do that thing. Stop talking to me. Let's say it. Right. Okay, so I need to do that. Yes, again. Wait, we can't talk right now. I gotta do this thing with the jellyfish. Right? Come on, jellyfish. Oh. 
Maybe it'll let me complete my dialogue before it starts spitting those things out at me, right? Here we are again. The jellyfish are stealing all the light, as they've stolen all hope from me. I'll never get used to it. Alright, you can do your thing again. Are you up for it? Of course. Don't be scared. They'll be coming straight for us. Right. She doesn't like that, though. It's fine. I had to do the thing that you don't like, because I need this. This ladder is... Doing this with a ladder makes things a lot easier. Just so I can reach them all. Wow, I can't reach some of them, though, because they're way too high. Oh, I missed that one. No! Okay, come on. Uh-oh, it's coming. It's coming! No, oh, get back here! You're way too high. I can't reach that. What the hell? Just one. Yep. Oh, I can slide off the roof. I didn't even know that. Nice. I can't reach that one. Already gone. Is that it? Oh no. Ooh, ooh come back here. Nice, nice! Well, at least they're all coming towards me, that's good. Can't reach that. Oh, they're kind of, ooh, wow. Heck yeah, heck, give me all your glims. Give me all your glims. I don't think I can get that high. <laughs> nope. We're gonna have to upgrade the boat for that. it we're all good we're all good well well snack would be great right about now okay I'll see what I can do you won't eat that you won't eat that ah, okay what can I cook her she won't eat the fruit either let me check my garden and see how fast this thing actually grows water I'm just going to make her a fish. Yeah, we'll do that. And then I will set the boat, and we will set sail for fail. Kidding. We're going to go to the flotsam over here to make best use of our time. Jumping off the boat to pick up the mussels and shells off the side is probably not a good idea while the boat's in motion. Just a thought. <clears throat> I was also told that my voice doesn't come all the way through sometimes. I apologize for that, but I just moved my mic a little closer, so hopefully that helps. Alright, here we go. We got fish. I know she doesn't like to eat the same thing every day, but it's all I got, so you're just gonna have to take it. Here, have a fish. Thanks, love it, good. And she's happy, that's even better. Oh wow, this is a long trip. Well, let's get some fishing in, I guess. I still think there's gonna be something, like, not just boots and herring. There's gotta be other things here. So far, though, herring. Just herring. Well, it's already... Overtime! Okay. Alright, we've arrived at our destination. Gotta wait for the boat to stop moving. First things first, we'll loot this stuff off of here. When Stella or Daffodil leave the boat, it stops. 
Oh, did I jump prematurely? No. Okay. What's in the What's in the box? Looks like lots of seeds. Empty bottle and a couple more maple logs. All right, and we need to dive. Limestone, right. Is there anything out here? Doesn't appear to be the case. Okay, okay. Hmm. My crops look good. All right, so that's all done. Let's go take a look at our crops. Give us an idea of how long they take to grow, right? Oh, it doesn't need water. No, it's not asking for it. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and do it anyway, just to be thorough. There's probably one more cycle. Because it doesn't look tall yet. Um, actually, no, I don't have anything to tell her yet. So, let's get underway, now that we looted this, right? Yeah, we did. Okay, so, I, what is that? Oh, the Mostine Cove. This was Hummingbird. Ooh, there's more flotsam here. Okay, so this actually does uh, replenish. Treasures, ores, and yeah, we're going there. But, like the last time, we are out of time for the day. So this was the next 30, episode 2 of Spirit Fair, as you watch me fish away my, my cares and worries for the world as we're underway. But anyway, um, I want to thank you for taking the time to watch, and if you're new to my channel, welcome, and if you're a regular here, welcome back. Either way, maybe check out my other playlists and see if my other interests may be of interest to you. Um, I'm definitely doing a mini-series on this, I really do like this game. So, anyway, we're going to go ahead and continue fishing while we're underway, and we will catch you on the next episode. Later.